Hello everyone, Jet here, and welcome back to my Stellaris playthrough as Daggerate Spork Empire. Where we're, we're in, in a bit of a consolidation phase at the moment. We are definitely going to go to war with these guys at some point sooner or later, or they will go to war with us, which we're actually quite looking forward to. Um, I'm also going to try and start jumping a few more, you know, colonising a few more planets. I just need to work out where's Scientific breakthrough worth achieved. doing, actually. Um, simply to, uh, well, to up my fleet capacity, because people does up my fleet capacity. Oh, unlock habitability modification. That means I can change some of my pops. Oh, I could get psionic army. I don't need a Sonic Army, this is very good, because um, this will uh, mean I can modify my guys so I can use more planets, which is actually a very beneficial thing, because, for example, Tomb Worlds, which I currently can't use, will be able to use. Um, I don't think I'll actually be able to use Tomb Worlds. Right, we're going to extend this sector out. This is a very good colonizable planet. Uh, not that, that's... Uh, 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 about barren molten rock. I don't want to colonise that. Right, we obviously want sporks here. Oh, I, I don't quite have the minerals to do it at the moment. Um, all of these guys in here are... Uh, the allying together, they have been crushed now. Oh, should I guarantee one of their independence? Now that would be fun to do. And the war's ended, but they haven't actually been captured. So which ones are most closely aligned to me? Not them. I'm going to guarantee the independence of the two spiritualist complete. factions in here. Which will cost me influence, but it means if they go to war with them, I have a good... Costas Belly to go to war with them um, because I'm now guaranteeing these two little uh, sectors dependence, independence um, because they're, they're good spiritualists uh, uh, against this horrible materialist empire here. Right, this is another good one to grab but I'm not sure I want to grab it just yet. Um, we're going to push up to here and maybe up to here. Um, right, let's speed up our time now. We're going, getting going. As soon as I can, I'm going to grab here. Then we'll expand this, expand this sector down to 13. That's a 17. That's worth grabbing in a 16. Um, you don't want too many sectors, but at the same time, you don't want too many planets Incoming stuck in these other things. Um, I'm at the point now where I can afford to start growing a bit because my planets are mostly in a very good state. Uh, not all. In fact, here needs to be uh, tinkered with a bit more. Oh, I do definitely need more research going on. How are we doing on food? We're fine Construction on food. Complete. And here has a paradise dome already, so you're going to go into... Ooh, you're going to grab one of them, because we've already got the, the opposite version of that. Let's get some more science going. Right, which are we lowest on? It's still social, so Biolabs give us that and let's clear all of these. Ooh, he's not happy. Well, tough. We've got a couple of things we can clear here. More, we might even just swap Mork stomping ground out. How big are these planets? Um, mm, he's 17, that's a 19. Yeah, I'm going to colonise here, and we're going to swap Mork stomping ground into one of the other things, so... Hmm... There's good. We're going to get three things from there. We'll lose the physics, but that's not the end of the world. But we'll gain buffs to all of them. And once that starts going, we will drop Mork Stomping Ground. Special project complete. Excellent. I do need to change this place's name, actually. Um, 
I'll have a think on what to call that one. I'm not. I'll do it just now. But I need, do need to start sorting my names a little bit more. Where have these come from? What sort of ships are they? They are special ships. Uh, can I modify their designs? I'm really not fussed. They don't fit in with my current fleet, so we're just going to disband that little fleet. Right, let's get ourselves some... Oh no, we don't have enough for edicts at the moment. Oh, we can get the energy edicts, because we do need some edicts going. So let's get a recycling, healthcare, and education campaigns going to up, buff up all my people. Right. You can come down back over here. Now you can grab here. It's a 22 hour world, that's well worth grabbing, but again, I'm not too keen on pushing too far out here. So no, for now, eh, we're gonna push out. I, I lose the territory, I lose the territory. But for now, I think I can afford it. I've got a good hold point, so. You can push forwards to here, you can push forwards to here. Oh, the Ungrak Imperium has fallen. Oh, they're making claims on us. Where are the Ungrak Imperiums? Oh, wow, so this little thing has completely gone. And now these guys are muscling up towards me. Um... Special project complete. You know what? For now, I'm forming a non-aggression pact with these guys, so I, can, I don't just don't don't have to watch this side of me, because this is going to be a brutal war when it happens. Construction complete. Tile blocker cleared. No, you still can't quite get that. Build a research base there. That science ship's actually going somewhere to research. I'm, Construction I'm surprised. Complete. Yeah, we want to keep that going. We want to keep that going. Oh, do we not have the curators at the moment? Uh, let's get them. So the curators, guys, I can uh, get them to aid me in my research. And I can purchase. Oh, I can't quite afford it. That's 3,000, that's expensive, but that will help me massively as time goes on. Um, because it's a 10% buff to your research, which as you can imagine is fairly good. Construction complete. Right, how's my unity doing? Um, I'm burning through this one. My next one I'm going to get is the one which clears planets for me. and means I can actually make my planets larger. Construction which complete. will be very good. Because Duroc is also only a 17. System but I might always complete. also change there at some point. What's worth building here? Energy. And another energy. Oh wow, there's a lot going on. So yeah, we've got some really powerful stations. You do Incoming not. Transmission. You, where's my fleet? Do not want to be an aggressive stance, actually, and you want to pull back a little bit. This means that he's in a safer state. Ooh. They want a non-aggression pact. Who are they? They're the other side of my wormhole, so we'll throw them that. Now we've got Gauss cannons. Ooh, what next? Ooh, that's good. Um... Oh, 
I'm going to get citadels to upgrade my defences. These guys both need buffing up, actually, because these guys are a bit weak at the moment. That said, I'm a little low on energy as well at the moment, so... You guys can go be upgraded. And this one specifically needs to actually be able to hold its own, because this one's probably going to be left on its own at the start of the war. You guys can go be upgraded as well. This is our, our... ships have been made superior. Ooh, you our are ships not have ready. Been you need to superior. get yourself in a situation there. You need to get yourself turned into a uh, star base there. That's the words I was after. And we can actually have a few more stations now, so we're probably going to get some trade, extra trade hubs going. How big is that? Several craven civilizations have joined together in a federation. Oh, there is a federation now up the other side. Alright, these two have stations. You've got a station. You've definitely got a station, but I can't build on you. You can get a station because this will get upgraded into. This is going to be a. That'll put the us up to 40. Of a new world has begun. Is there a planet we in here? Yeah. And this one could be up. These guys are going to be turned into energy producing stations, guys. Okay, right. Now what we need to do is you need to get put into this. So. He's, he's going to get put into our sector, guys. Um, which sector is that? Simply because it means I've, I can only have four core worlds at the moment, guys. And that means my new planet I'm grabbing will not... Uh, will um, Well, it buffs up this sector really nicely. But also means I don't have to worry quite so much about that, co that, that core world. Um, sorry, about that little world, and I can build up this one to get my research really going. Situation log updated. Okay, so this, this federation Construction is, is looking big. If we look at uh, the diplomatic map, so these guys are all one... The unions map go out. These guys are all one union now. That's quite a big bunch of allies, actually. Um, yeah, so these guys are all one, and these guys are all in association status. I suspect this Our is going to grow. Our ships have been made superior. Incoming transmission. Okay, I'll accept Federation Association status for now. Just to keep them on side. I not necessarily want it long run, but it keeps them happy with me for the time being, basically. The Federation's kind of protecting them as well, so... Ooh! What's going on here? So we're going to brief... Oh, this is the old factory. I want to rescue the energy production for the moment. Uh, I don't care who that is. Somebody's got a good customer. It's one of these guys, complete. I think. But... Okay, right, you guys can actually move back up here and then upgrade. Get the 
of mining underway there. Station's done. Right. Get extra unity. That's going to help us get these out faster. Hmm. Not much going on at the moment. We're kind of just getting ourselves sorted out again here. Um, here's going to be settled soon, so I want a big chunk of cash when that's done. Let's just have a quick check of my sectors at the moment. Construction complete. Um, some have got spare energy, which I don't really need just now. Incoming transmission. Get some mining stations on the way. I'm not going to expand any further up there. System hmm. survey complete. Where was it? I built the other thing. Ah, here. These are all going to be energy stations, guys. Um, we're getting around these stars. So we're going to get lots of trading hubs up, which will uh, basically give us a lot more energy. Buff up our energy production, which is what's lowest at the moment. And a lot of these planets, all of my sectors are... I do believe all of my sectors are on energy production. Yes. Construction complete. That's really good for us. Um, a new conflict has erupted. We have established Ooh. a new. So they're at war with base. people up there. I guess there now. Survey complete. Okay, and we've got this planet going. First things first. Let's clear this. Let's get some energy out here. Let's get ourselves a temple going. That's one of our most important buildings, obviously. And that'll do to start with. Hmm... one is definitely worth colonizing. Um, these guys are going to be better here. Slap bang there. Complete. Um, I'm going to chuck that one straight in a sector though, guys. Nice. We're getting there. System survey complete. Right, we've lost a scientist somewhere. Let's pause while we sort that out. Okay. System survey complete. Right, you can move back down here. You can stay up here. You can head back up onto this border now. As well, you can stay aggressive just in case. Oh wow! Scientific breakthrough achieved. Incoming transmission. What? Have these guys managed to break out off from these guys somehow? Oh, extra research speed. System Always extra research complete. speed. That was unexpected, having them pop up. I don't think they're going to live long. Right, let's check this station. Let's get a couple more anchorages out here. Because that uh, obviously gets me more ships. We are at our maximum amount of stations at the moment. 
you have been built up, so you can get a couple more as well. Let's just go down through here this way. Right, you're, you need extra. That's this station, so that definitely needs a buff. You need to be upgraded. As do you, as do you. Um, you're fine for the moment. You are not needed there anymore. For no, we can change you. You are going to be changed to Trading Hub. Welcome to your new role. Yeah, he can stay like that, he can stay like that. This is already a trading hub. Oh, and we're a little skint on minerals at the moment. We're going to start throwing out some extra trading hubs up here. System survey complete. Construction complete. You are definitely a trading hub. Okay, this should uh, get us a, a bit more, a bit more going. Uh, somebody's ethics, ethics have changed. I don't really complete. care that much. So uninhabited world. Da -da 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 -da. Let's share them with my empire. Ew! I made people xenophiles. I'm not really that fast. I was hoping it would uh, create more spiritualistness, which you can do sometimes. That'll do for now. We're getting them nicely. I'll go back and have a look at those again in a bit to get them sorted. But for now, we're doing nicely. How are these guys compared to me at the moment? Equivalent. Oh, they Systems actually have a planet here complete. now. With a single horrible materialist on it. They will definitely be expelled from my territory, guys. When I make that my territory, obviously. Same, because that gets us more. Construction complete. Wow, these guys are a. You know, they're offering everybody association status. Hmm. System survey complete. This is literally just to humiliate them. Um, Special project complete. Which... Uh, causes the... Okay. Causes their populace to not like them. Do we want to do this? They will have those guys defending them. No, I'm, I'm not ready just yet. Let's grab one there. I'm going to create a little external section here. Um, if I, these guys ever go to war with me, I will be instantly, you know, I will lose these planets very quickly. That Scientific is the danger. Scientific breakthrough achieved. Right. Oh, we've got the habitability modification. Oh, extra naval capacity. Oh. No naval the capacity at the moment. The conquest of a new world has begun. Right, do we have any big worlds which we can't currently use? Other than tomb worlds. I don't think I can modify my people to, to use tomb worlds, unfortunately. A 21 alpine world. 
um, which is in one of my sectors, which is really good because it means I can actually keep control of it. Um, now, what we can do is we can modify a pop. Can we modify an individual population before we move it here? This is the question. So, we need to make a alpine orc. Which prefers alpine territory. Now. Can I apply that to a single spore? Or do I have to apply it to an entire planet? Looks like I've got to apply it to an entire planet, which is a little annoying. Because um, I will basically kill that planet I apply it to. Um, that's really annoying. I wish I could apply it to a single spore. Um, because resettling the entire planet will get expensive. Because even that one is two, so two pops is two, so there's a hundred per pop, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So I could afford that, but still. Yeah, we're gonna convert the population of Blondie. I, I've got a planet called Blondie, guys. Don't worry about that. Um... Nearly as good as the, the uh, science sport, the orc called Keith. So what was it doing? Yes. So Alpine Orcs, apply the template to... Here. Oh no, here is best, because there's only five there. Situation log updated. Wherever that is, there were only five, so that's really not going to be bad. And then we can get a really nice alpine world get there. Right, it's on pause. Construction complete. What we'll do is once we've converted them guys, we will um, have a huge issue on that planet, to be fair. Uh, but we'll um, get a colony ship on its way there straight away and then we'll convert them back. Hmm. Yeah, you can get you can reinforce your fleet now. We've got much better System finance survey now. Complete. Right, I need to wait on this a little bit to get this going as well. Don't worry guys, we will be getting another war soon. It's just I need to get my empire in order again first. Uh, I also do want to buff up all of these simply to get them going. Oh, why are you not? Construction complete. Special project complete. Because um, all of these stations can go bigger. And the bigger I get, obviously, the more energy I'm going to get out System of them, which will be good. Complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Okay. System survey complete. And of course, we've got a wormhole straight into there as well when we do go. We've also got this, which I'd like to repair at some point, which will get us a nice big chunk of extra energy too. However, I need the technology first. And a lot of minerals. System survey complete. I'm not sure I'm going to be going to those techs anytime soon, so... Oop, here we go. System survey complete. That's going to be nice. Building a starbase upkeep and reduced naval upkeep. Right, we'll do ship upkeep first, because that's going to be a huge boost to us. 
what else is worth us grabbing in here? More defensive. Construction complete. Construction complete. Plus my own ships to an extent, but I don't necessarily want that. Systems upgrade all of those. Complete. What's the size of this place now? 14k guys. Our ships have been made superior. That is a nice station. This one's more of a, 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 a speed bump at the moment, but our ships have been made superior. Hmm. Oh, target top link center. That allows extra weapon range. That'll be good. We've already got that. I can't double up on that. Um... Do the communications jammer to just debuff their enemy ships a little bit more. This station is just epic, and it's there is another level above this, guys. Um, which doesn't give you much more in buildings, but it's just just a tougher station in general. Um, we also get ion cannons System for our stations later complete. on, which are hugely good. Well, let's upgrade the smaller stations first, because we'll get more from them being upgraded. System survey complete. You can all be upgraded. Construction complete. Spice must flow. It's a deal. And we want to get our curators going as well again. Uh, so let's go to here. Let's talk to the curators. Can you aid us in our research? We would like to purchase this surface. There you go. We've also got 10% extra research now. I can't quite afford that at the moment. That's fine. We have established a new planetary base. You know what? I could just chuck Darok into a. What's my biggest current planet? No, I can't afford to do that. So you are going to become a, your own little sector. We will help you out to start with. And let's... Uh, funnel some cash into that sector as well. Let's get that sector set up properly. Oh. Yeah, we're going to leave this. I'm not going to take anything from this sector to start with. We're just going to pump some materials into it to get it going. Okay, I need to keep an eye on my food production as well. Species adjusted. Okay, right, we now have a trouble planet. And I'm now too skint to colonise here. Oops, why am I spending money when I'm trying to save for this? System survey complete. As soon as Incoming I transmission. This, we're going to decline that for the moment. Where will I want to put it? Here. And pause again. Okay, some people don't like me. Unsurprisingly. Right, you can go down there, start getting Blondie Prime done, and right, 
we're going to leave this one here, guys. As always, thank you very much for watching. I do hope you are enjoying watching the uh, Dagger 8 Spork Empire slowly expanding across the uh, the uh, galaxy and in bringing the uh, galaxy to the enlightenment of Gork and Mork. Um, we're going to keep on with this as well. Um, you know, we're going to have a good war up here soon. That's going to be fun. I need to get some... Uh, start making claims up here actually we'll do that next time because we're gonna have to fight this more conventionally actually by making claims on their territories and um i need to see what's going on down here but i'm happy to leave the status quo down there for the moment anyway as always thank you very much for watching guys please feel free to throw comments down in the comments obviously or jump over to my discord which is linked in the comments and the description there are also links there to my Twitter and my Patreon, guys. To anybody who can do anything on my Patreon, that is absolutely fantastic. Nothing will ever be shown on here. On my, there, there, can't talk. Nothing will ever be shown privately to anybody on my Patreon. Everything will be shared publicly, guys. I'm, I'm not going to ever keep anything hidden. However, any anything which does come in from that, because I'm not monetized at the moment, will go towards upgrades to make all of this content better. At the moment, I really need a graphics card. So it will all go into a sort of savings for a new graphics card at some point. Um, and my Twitter there, guys. But by always, jump over to Twitter, Discord, wherever, just to say hi. And thank you very much for watching.